next at 155, Benny Orozco. Here is Benny Orozco, fighting out of Team Gumlin Dyer. His, his opponent, Dawajan Spatsuman. Surin. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are almost out of here. There are two fights left, one fight after this, which is a title fight, so stick around. Both of these upcoming fights are 155 pounds. In the blue corner, he's 27 years old and fights for Team Doom Demaya out of Antioch, California. Professional debut fight. Yes, baby. Let's go. In the red corner, fighting out of the Dragon House in San Francisco. He's 35 years old with a professional record of seven and four. He is Dawa Jam Spotsude. Your referee for this fight is John Toll. And here we go, round one. Right away, a big takedown attempted from Benjamin Orozco. So far, defended nicely from his Batsuren. opponent. Batsuren, yet another Mongolian fighter, trains at Dragon House MMA in San Francisco, California. But he hails from Ulaanbaatar, Mongolia. Benjamin Orozco trains and fights out of Antioch, California, across the pond. Looks like Batsuren grabbed the cage briefly. Batsuren coming in with a record of a seven and four, his adversary making his MMA debut. Orozco so far has done a nice job controlling his opponent. What he should and can do more of is ground and pound. Uh, we have not seen enough of it here tonight. Batsuren doing a great job at defending that takedown. Could not agree more. Although he is not in the best position, it could be a lot worse, and he is not prevent he is not allowing Orozco to put him in a worse position. Cool, calm, and collected are both men. Nice knee there from Orozco. 
Now Roscoe needs more of that. And John Toll, our referee, given the first verbal warning to Temujin. Orozco lands a big right hand and he is right back to the takedown. Batsarin goes right down and he continues to fight from the bottom position. looking to do everything he can to fully bring down Batsarin to the mat. These Mongolian grapplers are just so good and so comfortable being put up against the fence. It's exceedingly difficult to take them all the way down as we've seen here in the first round tonight. Kevin Wallerosco may be frustrated he's not able to take down his opponent completely. He's still clearly winning the first round, so he shouldn't beat himself up too much. Right. Although everybody wants the finish and the big, flashy, spectacular win. On paper, a win's a win, and so far, Benjamin Orozco is winning the fight. Yes, indeed. Oh, it looks like they separated for a brief moment. Big leg. Oh, a big right from Baturin. Another takedown attempted and another defended. Right. Followed by another. And this oh. one is successful. The most successful takedown thus far attempted by Benjamin Orozco, who's looking to control the wrist now. And he is in a vastly superior position to what he was before. Ten seconds remain in our first round of a possible three. to work as the feeling out process is over. And right for a takedown, and Roscoe goes. Will he get another takedown? He certainly will, and now he's taken the back for the first time in this fight. Although he is riding a little high, he now goes oh. for a rear naked choke, which is Will he get it? Will he get it? It's in, it's in, it's in! His opponent refusing to tap. He may just be put to sleep. Although he's what a warrior! Fight. Beautiful, seamless transition oh, to a guillotine choke. Absolutely world-class grappling on display. It's in tight, it's in tight. Oh, brought to you by ExecuShield for all your security needs. In and and out he goes. Area. Right off that guillotine. Nice knee from Batarin. And a great takedown from Orozco. Orozco has had nothing but success with his takedowns here tonight, Kevin. Couldn't have said it better myself, Bobby.
Benjamin Orozco will try once again to take the back and look for a submission. He was very close to success before, and he's looking to lock in that rear naked choke once again. Oh, this time it is it? much it? tighter. And he gets the tap. Will tap. Benjamin Orozco, your winner via rear naked choke. He is now undefeated at 1 0 as a professional mixed martial artist, and he is humble and remains cool, calm, and collected. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, one minute and 58 seconds into round number two by tap out via rear naked choke, Benny Orozco. Benjamin Orozco is your winner via rear naked choke in the second round. Benny improves to one and oh. Of his professional debut. John Rayhoy once again with the official announcement. Speaking of guys named John, we got John Perulis, a hey, man making this stream possible. All my supporters right here, the OG squad, right here. I used to walk with them every day. Love you guys. My fam over here. Love you. Love you guys. The rest of the team, I see you all scattered. I love all you guys. Uh, shout out to my. Autistic sister, she's always worried about me. Love you. I ain't hurt, I got a little busted lip, but it's all good. Nothing Devin ain't hit me with. Uh, I wanna thank all my sponsors. Thank you every everybody that made it possible for me to be here. Thank you Andre, giving me a spot to train at. Fucking Devin, every day, training with me. No one wants to do it, he does it every time. Love him, can't be anywhere without him. Those two biggest things on me. Uh, you know, I just love all my fans, and we're doing big things. One and no, six and no all time. We ain't losing. I uh, love all you guys. Thank you. Congratulations, Benny Orozco.